Yeah, it says 64 gigabytes of RAM. Oh, what kind? Fucking other? What does that mean? 64 gigabytes of other. The fuck? I am. What up? So, I'm filming this on the phone, and it's echoey because this is a shit office that I am trapped in a lease. Now, I will just say, I'm not gonna sit here and be like, I'm trapped in a lease. I'm gonna cry about it. No, because I can't. Because I made mistakes, and now I'm gonna live with them. And I'm gonna live with my mistakes in the best way I know how. Spitefully. With, with spite. So, as you can see, what we're doing now is the pouring out of the water. <laughs> so you broke safe. I bought a piece of my intern and, and dust my back room. That sounded way worse than it can, can I wear them since you got them for me? So, guys, uh, these are actually great. <laughs> so, right now, we're deploying one. Two, three, four, five, six, sixteen. What? Computers in this room, including what's that? Two. I just counted. Was it six? Six. Six servers. Ideally, if you're like typically the four two years on the main power servers, and we're turning this place into a virtualization fault. <laughs> Now, technically this is client work. So the purpose of this is what the client wants. I just happen to be in possession of the space, the power, and the hardware. So I said, sure, I'll contract out my services as, a, as, as someone who knows what they're doing sometimes. God, my face feels so weird from those glasses. And I will uh, I'll host a virtualization. So right now I'm installing drives. And worst case scenario, this is about to be a voiceover with a bunch of music on it. On that note, I'm, like I said, I'm, I have tons and tons of hard drives. I don't think you guys understand the magnitude of this project. Over the course of the next few weeks, I will have your out updates, hopefully. And I will be deploying over a hundred CPU cores, over a terabyte of RAM, tens of terabytes of mechanical hard drives and SSDs. Like we have tons and tons, oh God, tons and tons and just tons of SSDs, tons of RAM. Like literally tons of RAM. This is 160 gigs right here of these LPR DIMMs. Low profile DDR4 registered DIMMs. GCC registered. This shit's lit. I forgot I was wearing a hat. Do we have more hard drives around? All right guys. So this is my super micro server. It has two CPUs, one under here. Now, I actually have to take this off to put in RAM, so I don't mind. I hate how this is designed. Because it's designed to piss me off. Almost on purpose. Like, what are you stuck on? So, this is my super micro server. Ow. This is my super micro server. It has two 1200 watt power supplies that are there. I modified the fans because since it's not running many graphics cards, uh, fucking, I don't know, dude. So, here's the thing. This has two 8-core Xeons. Now, if we do two threads per VM, that means we have a total of 36 threads, which gives us a total of 18 VMs. Now, 16 times 2, we have 32 threads, which gives us 16 VMs. I can't do math. 16 VMs with roughly 3 gigabytes each is roughly 48 gigabytes of RAM. Round that up, we do 64 gigs, which means we need a total of four of these low profile ECC RDIMs, which are each 16 gigabytes. That gives us dual channel per CPU. And if the camera knows where the camera should go, uh, we're gonna try to install this right now. 
It is, I need to buy more of this stuff. It's adorable and it's really cheap on eBay. Delicious. Now we have RAM. Could you tell? No? Great. I need a graphics card, I think. Some kind of accelerator for this. I should have brought a low profile, but. Perfect! A graphics card. Thank God I happened to buy like 10 of these. So, for these VMs, thank you. They're doing very simple tasks. Some of them, some of them need high performance. For the high performance ones, we're gonna go with some of these. FirePro S9300 X2s, which I've modified to recognize as R9 Fury Xs. Two of them in any Windows or Linux applications. And these will be perfect for GPU acceleration. <laughs> but they're unnecessary in this video, or in, the, in this server for now. And also, I, also, I don't feel like it. That's it. If the airflow pattern isn't correct, because the air would just blow around it because I don't have covers for it. So I'm just going to go with one of these. What happened the second one? Oh. Sorry. If I'm going to use one, I might as well use both while I'm here. It'll make me feel better about myself. So I'm just going to grab a second WX4100. If we're going to go with what? Eight, 16 VMs? Something like that? Two, two threads each? You might as well have two graphics cards. That's, you know, like I said, they have very lightly graphically accelerated is words. I think the profile gives them like 256 Wait. megabytes. <laughs> 256 megabytes of graphics memory. Come around and pop in the front here. And this does have a SATA backplane. One. Please work so that I don't look so stupid. What? Do you shit your pants? <laughs> <laughs> no. There we go. Three Santa drives. Why not? Now this server is actually done. So we can close it up. And hope. Ow. Why am I struggling so much with this? There we go. That is now a complete server ready to have. It sticks up. I mean, it hooked up to do shit. Now, I'm just gonna do the rest and then cut back to when I'm done. <laughs> what is that? What am I looking at? What the fuck? Oh, wait. Okay. On hour like fucking 19 of the server build shit. On another fucking server. What a surprise. Old windows on those servers already. Wow. And those. Holy shit. That's a mess. It's a fucking mess in here. Holy shit. This fucking sucks. That's it. And my hands in the way. Did I just steal your job? No. Uh-oh. I really just end up in the fucking shell again? Fuck!